Hello everybody. Welcome back to the vlog. It's been a while. Got a little bit of an update. A little bit of a vlog. Um, don't want to talk for too long, but yeah, we've been gone for a while. We've just been training, competing, um, nothing too out of the ordinary for this time in the season. Um, this previous weekend we just had uh, Ontario Championships. Um, I did discus, jab, pole vault, and ran a 4x1. Um, Caroline did 100 meters and triple jump. <clears throat> and before that we had both competed in smaller meets. I did a little bit of long jump. Caro did some meets from uh, full approach. So yeah, we've just been competing, um, training hard. Uh, the Achilles for myself is getting a little bit better. Um, I should be good for nationals next week. Um, a lot of like that really harsh pain is gone. So now it's just like, gets a little bit irritated, um, just a little bit sore. So I think we can kind of get rid of that by next week. Um, been doing a lot of stuff with uh, Evan, um, just working on it, uh, trying to keep the calf really loose. Um, started using ultrasound on it, uh, my Achilles and my knees. Um, hopefully that works as well. Been doing that almost every single day. Um, so yeah, just working away. Um, so these are the clips of us competing at well, first is me competing at one of the field series meets. Went from 13 strides or 12 strides for long jump. Uh, jumped 690, so feels pretty good. Um, with a little bit of speed behind me, I think I can jump pretty far um, at nationals, so that felt good. Um, these clips are of Ontario Championships last week, or last weekend that just passed. Um, so yeah, Caroline had a good series, um, a bunch of jumps over 1320s, or one or two, or three jumps over that. Um, so she's feeling good, knees feeling good. And for myself, uh, pole vault didn't go the greatest. I didn't know height, so that's good but I only jumped 450, which is my opening height. Um, this is the first jump. So yeah, just like cleared it by a huge amount, but didn't push the pole away. So that's fine. And then this is my clearance. And yeah, just trying to figure out which poles to jump on from six strides um, or six lefts. So just not exactly sure which ones to go on. So. The, after that height we moved up a pole and then I just couldn't get through it so we know that for nationals now. Jav was not the greatest either uh, through 51 and a half. Um, yeah it's just not feeling the greatest but that's okay we still got some time we're gonna work on it this week gonna work on the run up uh, just get that rhythm back. Um, so my PB is 58 um, from a full approach but Full approach for me isn't much different than just doing three strides. I don't get that much faster doing a full approach. So hopefully I can get back to there. Um, and then discus the next day, it was a torrential downpour. It was brutal, just brutal. Uh, there was like this much water in the circle. So it was from, like it filled up the entire circle and was going just level with the track. Um, and I do not throw the greatest in the rain. I don't think anybody does. Um, so I just like sprayed my entire hand with glue, just got that sucked in there and then just went for it, almost PB through 45.98. Uh, my PB is 46.33, so that was a great day um, other than the rain. Um, so hopefully in like perfect conditions, we can go like 46, 47, 48. So on the schedule today, just gonna go lift. Um, it's about 11.30 and then we have to go to St. Thomas to practice today uh, just cause the track is getting resurfaced 
it, they're just redoing a part of it. I think the 100 meters straight. So we have to go to St. Thomas to practice, got hurdles, and then some speed endurance. Um, hurdles, there's a bunch of runs over eight hurdles. And then speed endurance is a split 400. So it's gonna be hard, but it's gonna be a good day. So yeah, I will see you guys in a bit. Hello everybody. Um, sorry, it's really close to my face. Um, so we are at uh, in St. Thomas. Um, just got here, kind of start to warm up. Uh, so today's workout is hurdles and speed endurance. So I think it's um, a couple over one, a couple over two, and then two over eight hurdles. And then I have a split 400, so 200 out of blocks. Weighted a couple, I don't know if it's a, technically a split, uh, it's like two minutes or three minutes recovery and then finish like I'm running a 400. And then, yeah, then we're all done so. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Uh, yeah. Okay, as you can see, I can shave my head. Probably already saw that. Uh, okay, but now, uh, all done with that. Oh, now just gonna rest. And then, yeah, I have the 200, rest 200. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna film it, just cause it's too hard to get yeah, everything. So I'll let you know how it goes. All right, we are all done so now. Uh, yeah, the first 200 felt harder than I wanted it to, and the oh, second 200, ow, I just rolled my ankle. And the second 200 felt a lot harder than what I wanted it to. So first one was 23 and then 23.5, I think, uh, which is a good pace for me. And then the second 200 was 25 and a half. So that was a little slow, but yeah, with how the past like three months have gone, can't complain. Um, so yeah, that's the last speed endurance workout until nationals when I run the 400. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a good week. Uh, I'll see you guys before the week's done. And yeah, so thanks for watching. Subscribe, give it a thumbs up. And thank you. Bye.